She actually inks those. These are inks by Tina Cornelius in Passionate Artisans. Do take a stroll around and see what we have. Linda's hats, children's hats. Some of May's art. And some wonderful little pieces. Flower magnets and handworks magnets. Oh, look at these. These are new. Kenna knits, little knitted purses. How cute are they? And Colleen's Awaken my senses. Maze art tiles. This lovely corner of linens. This is Julia Joyce's linens. Some lovely pieces handmade for home decor using some vintage work. You really have to come and see this. Some more Kenna knits, very colorful, cotton. And some of Linda's children's outfits. And so from Kingston Soap Company. Past Times has some wonderful vintage wooden items for home decor. Or at this time of the year, maybe even something for the cottage. These are delicious Bruce Wood handmade cookies, shortbread, a variety of flavors, and artistic double panes, some glass. This time of the year, you're starting to think about shower and wedding presents. There's some lovely pieces here. It would be perfect. can see we're right across from Canadian Tire. Ooh, Paul Laren's wonderful uh, granite tabletops and slabs for your kitchen cutting boards. Maybe something to go on the patio when the snow is finally melted off it. Some more glass, felting, felted with this, some wearables, Carolyn Barnett. Oh, we have some lovely new work here. Oh, Westridge Arts. Westridge Arts, that's what that is, yeah. And some knits, some light knits. Some lovely spring pieces from Linda. Oh, this is lovely. 
Woodland Market. This just gives you a bit of a view of what we have in Passionate Artisans for spring. More of Ken and Knits. Maybe they'll be in the fashion show April 26th. We have Dave Blair's beautiful jewelry. And some silk jewelry. This is new. Sarah Decker. A little bit of bling, a little bit of silk. Some lovely pieces here. So, come down and visit Passionate Artisans. Running wild with creativity.